Let's talk about uh, American Gods. This uh, is the new show that you're doing uh, on Stars, and I, I can't begin to summarize the plot. It is a fascinating show, fascinating. but it's not. It's unlike any show I've seen before. It's very different. Best way I can explain it to y'all is um, it's four worlds coming together. It's based on the great Neil Gaiman book, um, mm -hmm. The American Gods. Uh, we have the old gods like Easter, my yep. character, and the new gods like Media and Techno Boy and mm -hmm. how it all works together. And I think they've done an incredible, incredible job of making old versus new. Also, it begs the question, and this is kind of deep, but how far are we willing to go with our world today? You know, we change so quick yep. all the time, right? And how far are we willing to go? What is our personal boundary? I remember when Twitter happened, I thought, I gotta know if I'm gonna get on board here. Sure. Twitter, you know, tweet, tweet. But now, <laughs> I'm obsessed. So we'll see, but I just, I'm very proud to be in it. Um, my character's introduced um, in the last episode and it's Easter, um, the goddess of the earth and I love fertility. That. You're, you're, it's perfect. It's a great role for you, goddess. Yo, yo, you really are. You, you're the goddess of uh, Easter fertility and I like that it's Easter with uh, sort of a sexy gleam in your eye. Well, she's got a little, she's got a little mad that Jesus has decided to resurrect on her special day, but um, it's... <laughs> <laughs> but it's a, but I like it because um, I'm I am a Christian person, so I I look at I also am you know I don't judge other people for their beliefs, so right. I look at a lot of different beliefs and this this show is so fascinating and I just hope people watch it. I think they're watching it. It opened uh, Sunday night while I was on stage at Boston.